Additional funding was provided by Symbolics Inc., a major manufacturer of symbolic processing systems for developing and running complex software, and by these companies and foundations. For information about this and other Annenberg Media programs, call 1-800-LEARNER and visit us at www.learner.org. I would lose weight, stop, gain it all back, go back to another doctor, uh, do the same thing. Very good, you lost half a pound. The difficulty of dieting. December 30th. Questions about the draft lottery of 1970. The survival of Florida's manatees. What's all this got to do with statistics? Find out next on Against All Odds. Annenberg Media. Additional funding was provided by Symbolics Inc., a major manufacturer of symbolic processing systems for developing and running complex software, and by these companies and foundations. drunken sailors, and also known as sea cows today. Power boats, necessary for some, pleasurable for others, sharing the sea with the manatees. What do these two have to do with each other? And how can we picture that relationship statistically? Questions about relationships come up all the time. For instance, how is income related to education, or how is height related to nutrition? How do we analyze relationships between variables? That's what this program is about. We'll see how to use a scatter plot to display the relationship between two quantitative variables. We'll learn how to add a third categorical variable on a scatter plot. And we'll learn how to find a least squares regression line and see how it's used for prediction. The clearest way to picture the relationship between two things is with a scatter plot. Scatter plots are the ideal graphical technique when you want to determine the relationship, if any, between two quantitative variables. Remember that quantitative variables are measured in numerical units, units we can mark on an axis and do calculations with. We're going to make a scatter plot to show the relationship of power boats to manatee deaths. But first, let's take a look at the situation in Florida where manatees and power boats share the sea. <laughs> These strange creatures are manatees, a species of marine mammal found along the coasts of Florida. Manatees are slow-moving, gentle, unafraid, and extremely curious, endearing traits, but ones which are posing a threat to manatee survival. This manatee here is using our, a line that we call the dental flossing line for manatees. They like to chew on them. 
you're not real careful when you start your motor. 